Growing up in the Midwest, the Wienermobile is something of a legend, a lore, a rumor, something you hear about on the highways, getting offered a spot as one of 12 hot doggers out of six to 7,000 that apply each year. It's a very prestigious role and one I'm very uh, thankful I was offered. Growing up in high school, I always had a passion for film and kind of knew that film and entertainment was the route I wanted to go. So when I started looking at schools, USC was kind of like the no-brainer. When I first started at Annenberg, one of the big things that I was really excited about was obviously our media center. I initially started doing a weekly radio ep like episode, writing copy, doing script, recording in the studio, just to get that experience. And it was something I really enjoyed. My very first semester I started at the USC Athletics Football Department. So I started doing sidelines for football games, sidelines for water polo, helping create content for the USC Athletics Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, but also kind of wanted to shift into uh, entertainment a little bit more. So one of the first internships I got was at NBC Universal, right on the studio lot. I worked for Red Bull as a student brand rep uh, and a marketeer. So I managed the entire USC campus in terms of Red Bull with product, partnering with local student groups, partnering with different events to make sure we had product. I kind of made my own way of uh, finding the business side of entertainment and film while also getting all of that experience in the comm school and journalism school, talking with people, doing PR, doing marketing. And somehow, uh, one way or another, it translated into driving the Wienermobile full time. <laughs> and as you step in, we're gonna ask that you watch your step because we did spill a little bit of mustard on the floor. This one right here is the driver's seat. This is where I will be sitting on my drive days in which we travel about 500 miles a week. I've been to about 26 different states and that has comprised a little over 30 cities to travel the hot dog highways for a year. If you see me rolling down the street and you give me a wave, I might hit the horn and it'll sound a little bit like this. Oh, I wish I were an Oscar Mayer wiener. <laughs> if I were an Oscar Mayer wiener. Everyone would be in love with me. In a typical year, we would be doing a lot of grocery stores, obviously, which is where the product is sold, where we're giving out the coupons and everything. With everything that happened this year, we did do kind of a major change in that we did not do any grocery stores and moved into more local community events. If you would believe it, we do have um, almost a full day of pun training at our training, which is called Hot Dog High. And we learn buns and buns of examples. Right here is for my co-pilot. Uh, we call this one Shot Bun. It does come equipped with its very own meat belt. We also have no bad days in the Wienermobile because we're always under blue skies. Our mission this year has been to spread miles of smiles. And that's because the Wienermobile is such a tool to do that. Like you see it, you can't not have a smile on your face. I think something this job has taught me is that like, it takes a really little amount of effort to just absolutely change someone's day for the better. I think what's gonna stick with me is just like, do good, like keep trying to make people smile. I'm gonna definitely be searching for opportunities where I can kind of chase that same feeling of just bringing joy to people.